Hello, very short video today. Just wanted to touch briefly on the fact that 343 did release um, Legendary Firefight into Halo Infinite. Obviously, um, comments from myself, lots of other Halo creators and fans in general uh, were saying that the standard and heroic modes for Firefight were pretty easy. Um, almost too easy. So, we wanted a Legendary Firefight. And I think everyone kind of thought it would come um, January, you know, after 343 comes back, after their um, leave for Christmas. Uh, but surprisingly, it dropped with the Winter Contingency update, and I've given it a go. Um, so, <laughs> um, I did manage to win uh, my third game. <laughs> so it's definitely an increase in difficulty, which is nice. Um, the first two games I played... Um, we're gonna, you know, we're gonna slash one off because um, it was a three versus the enemies. You know, my um, one of my teammates quit, um, so we can kind of push that one to the side. Um, second one, we just weren't good enough. We had no idea what to expect. Uh, you know, we got past the first round, secured the hill once, and then the second round, we just got obliterated, and we all died in the space of about 20 seconds. Um, so we could no longer just rush in and kill all the enemies, you know, b while being surrounded by them. Um, you can't really stay inside the hill for the whole time because you're just going to get swarmed by enemies that are now absolute tanks. Um, yeah, the AI aren't any smarter than they were before. Um, in my third game, you know, we won um, and we kind of learned how to outsmart the AI, I think, or at least I did. Um, I had entire rounds where I didn't get a single um, piece of health taken off me. I didn't get hit once. Uh, because I learned very quickly that the AI still obsess over the hill. So if you just move away from the hill uh, and go and stand behind them, they will pretty much just, you know, stand there and take all the shots. Um, they won't turn around and go to your position and try and kill you to stop you from doing so. They will just stand there clueless going, uh, me in hill, me no know what do, me get hit bleh, and die. So <laughs> um, there is ways around it. Um, but overall, like it's more difficult. It was a challenge for the initial games, which is what I liked. Um, I'm just making this initial video, you know, I'm, I'm three games in. Um, I'll do a follow up in maybe a day or two to let everyone know how I got on, because I'm going to go and play like another five or six and see if those end up getting easier and easier until I now claim that Legendary is too easy. Um, and we'll go from there. So yeah, so far, nice step up in difficulty, but I did think I said I don't want them to just become bullet sponges and do more damage. It would be nice in the future if rather than that, we actually made the AI smarter, which I know is a much bigger task to do, but I think overall it would create a much better experience. Um, so that's it, yeah. Um, other than this, over the weekend, uh, the 16th and 13th, English, the 16th and 17th, I know I could edit that out, but I'm just not going to do it. Uh, 16th and 17th of December, my video game Cross Planet, which is a third person um, shooter inspired by Halo. We had a playtest, uh, we had 420 something people uh, request access, which was nice. Um, I think over the period of promoting that playtest, which we did like a two, three week uh, promotion, we gained about 300 wishlists on Steam, which is insane. So thanks to anyone who wishlisted from this channel or even played from this channel. And uh, we're going to do a lot more playtests next year. So, you know, we might do like six more um, than we did this. I think this year we did three. So we, we might do six, uh, maybe seven next year. Um, you know, let, let's say average every six to eight weeks. So, uh, if you're at all interested, um, just go to Steam and wishlist Cross Planet, and um, yeah, we'll let you know when there's a playtest. All right, thank you for watching this video. I know it's a short one, but we'll have more content coming soon and in the new year. Uh, goodbye.